Generative design is sort of a term that people use to describe work that is more based on process and process explored through computation. So instead of designing a final product, like 3D modeling a certain shape or drawing a certain form, what if we think about designing computational processes that can grow or generate an infinite variety of shapes and forms that are interrelated in a certain way? The way that things grow, the way that cracks form, are all based on these physical principles that we can simulate and manipulate to study them and understand them in sort of a more intuitive way. So at Nervous System, we typically don't work with valuable materials. Instead, we put the value in the design work. So the ideas that we're encapsulating in the designs is what's really valuable, not the 3D printed nylon or stainless steel that they're made from. We make a lot of small scale objects like jewelry and jigsaw puzzles. And the reason we're focused on the, that scale of object is we want to make things that are affordable, that both we can afford to make and people can afford to buy. So we can share these broader ideas in a way that's very consumable. We were originally interested in the patterns of ammonite sutures. It's got these really articulated, sort of beautiful patterns. For our puzzle collection, we've been working a lot with this simulation called dendritic solidification that grows incredible sort of interlocking branching <laughs> forms based on how crystals emerge. We can sort of take these natural principles and make them into interactive systems for design. We're using art as a way to explore science in sort of a new way, because we're working with these very complex scientific ideas, but we have the freedom to sort of just explore them in a very open-ended way, where we don't have to be you know, convincing a government agency that we need a grant for this, we don't need to adhere to the rigors of scientific publication. We can just say, this system is really exciting and interesting and beautiful. Where does it take us?